Masyan ko po sa Rich. Ayun po pag isa na school, mas ganit e-learning and we all learn from our book, Amazing Science School for I'm the teacher, mas na Dr. Tazar. Welcome to the science class students. This is the continuation of unit number E, sound. First of all, we'll give you all learning what we have read in this lesson in the end of the third book work. Question number three, true and false. Before starting, I want to ask you, Earth, natural satellite. Yes, you are right. Moon is the Earth's natural satellite. Don't forget, students, if you are learning from unit number 13 as well. Now we come to what we already read in unit number 8, sound. So students, sound is what? Sound is a form of energy. It comes from a vibrating source. Sound travels in invisible waves. We cannot see sound. Sound can travel through solids, liquids, and gases. It means that sound requires matter to travel either in the solid or liquids or gases. These are the instruments that can produce sound. Now students, loud and soft sound. Students, if we strike a gong, what happens? We are just striking lightly you hear the sound slowly and if you are just listening oh, or this much sound that is the loud sound students now for the soft sound students like a flute Is it a nice sound? So that is the difference of loud and soft sounds. That the different kinds of vibration make different kinds of sound. If you strike a more hard, you will hear a louder sound. Or if you start to gently, you will hear a soft sound. This is because you make the bone vibrate more when you set it hard. As the vibrations become smaller, the sound becomes softer, isn't it? Now, how sound travels? Students, sound travels at different speeds through different materials. Some materials are made up of solid, some are liquid, and some are gas. So their speed of sound may vary in all these cases. But students, do you have, do you know that why we cannot hear the sound of explosion takes place on the sun? Because there is no air on the space. Sound cannot travel through space because there is no air there. This is why we cannot hear sound of explosions that take place on sun. Sound travels better through solid liquids and gases. They are much better uh, travels in solid liquid than gases. Sound waves can travel through doors and walls as well. As you for hear the ticking of the clock if you hold it between your teeth. You can also hear sounds in water when you are swimming underwater. Now, we are comes to the kinds of sounds, students. Students, if we like a sound, we call it musical. Uh, sounds which we find unpleasant or we don't like it, that is actually the noise. Musical sounds and noise are made by a number of different vibrations reaching our ear at the same time. Like this. Like this. What about when we are mixing it together? So definitely, it is good in this, right? Now we come to our activity on the book page number 17 and the activity is the 
of thin cardboard or you can use the when you have a tissue paper roll now that uh, the empty tissue paper roll so you can do so you can use to fasten the tubes together with a piece of tape to form an angle okay um these are taking too long add the free end of one of the tubes put your ear to the free end of the second tube can you hear the ticking like light sound also gets now, reflected just want to see what happens we are just watching the video as we know now that what is the reflection of sound that is the bounce back of uh, by uh, hitting a confined place or angle so we hear the sound again that is the reflected of sound that is the reflection of sound students but what actually happens if this uh, if we are to check that how what happens when the sound is reflected so we are just watch this video by looking at how why we are seeing the word reflection why we are using this reflection now I just want to share this video by watching this video the surface of a solid or a liquid like light sound also gets reflected at the surface of a solid or a liquid thus sound also follow the same laws of reflection let's find out here we have two identical pipes made of chart paper arranged near a wall a ticking clock is kept on the open end of one of the pipes try to hear the sound of the clock through the other pipe adjust the position of the pipes thereby changing the angle of the reflection so that you can best hear the sound of the clock we observe that the sound is loudest when the angle of incidence is equal to the angle of reflection it can hence be concluded that the reflection of sound waves also follow the same laws of reflection as light waves do So you now you can see that the reflection of the sound may vary. It will always have the angle of incidence and angle of reflection will be all same. Then you can hear the sound going nicely. Now equal. What is equal, students? That when the sound waves hit a barrier such as a cliff inside a well, so they bounce back. We hear the sound again. This reflected sound is called an equal. Somewhere. On the high cliff, there is always a equal vibration, equal point. So because are going there to just listen the voice that how many voices are coming. So that is depend on the cliff where you are. So that is actually the voice we are coming back in, and you can listen it again. So that is the echo. Now, what is echo detection? Why we are using echo detection, students? That echoes can be used to detect shoal of fish, some rains or wreck ships or the sea bed. The sound waves are sent down in the sea. You can see from an instrument on a ship called an echo sounder. Uh, the time taken from the echo to bounce back to the ship can be used to work out the position and shape of the object beneath the ship. Okay, maps of the seabed inside the sea that how much deep it is. Maps of the seabed can also be made in the same. And uh, what about the equal location, student? That is mostly the bats make high squeaking sounds and use their ears to pick up the echoes from the objects around them. As then they are making the sound, it will be striked by any object that is near to it. Especially the flying insects, they strike and come back to the bats, reflected back to the bat that is from the uh, that found the location of the insect. How much big it is? It how many? Uh, how much far it is? So that is the equal location. So bats use equal location to find their way. Now we come to the noise pollution stress. This noise is any sound that is unpleasant. It is any sound that we do not like. Noise is produced by jet, by airlines, mowing, mowing machines, of a cutting grass, 
rushing motorcycles and scooters, of course, the honking of horns on busy roads. Loud music can also be very disturbing if the volume is turned up for hours. Very loud voice can damage the ears, cause sleepless, sleeplessness, and in older people can left led to deafness. So that is actually the unpleasant voice that is called noise pollution. Now we come to today's maths students. Today's maths is question number three, true or false. You have to write it down in your notebook. Very loud sound can damage the eyes. No, it's a false statement. Very loud sound can damage the ears. Reflected sound is called ray. No, no, no. Reflected sound is either echo. Okay. So that is not a ray. That light, reflected light is called a ray. So that's also a false statement. Sound that we can found unpleasant is called music. No, 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 no. It is noise. So that is also a false statement. Sound cannot travel through solid. Again, these are false st statements. Students, sound can travel through solid, liquid, and gas, but sound cannot travel if there is no air or no matter there. Okay, so that's also a false statement. Movement that make the air shake back and forth are called vibrations. Yes, it is a true statement, students. Yes, the movement that make the air shake back and forth are called vibrations, and that vibration causes the sound. So, students, now. That will be all for today. Have your lunch or dinner or breakfast, wherever you are. Stay safe, stay blessed, students. Don't forget to wash your hands after using the gadgets and stay healthy. Love is to everyone. Thank you so much for listening.